everyone welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Naomi if you're new here then welcome to your first video here on my channel today we have a Primark haul which I'm really excited to show you what I picked up lately in Primark first of all I just want to say that we are actually in lockdown is it like 2.0 everyone's saying um so yeah second time round in lockdown so I just want to point out that I did pick these things up before Primark closed just so we're all aware that I've not been shopping during lockdown yeah so i just thought i'd show you what i got over the last little while i did pick up a few li little different bits and stuff so i thought it'd be a good video to kind of show you what i picked up and these are all kind of more like autumn winter um items as well so i just thought it'd be a good idea to do a little video and show you what i picked up so we're just gonna get straight on into the video and i'm gonna show you what i picked up and i'm also gonna probably put a little try and clip maybe this side of the video so you can see obviously what i picked up and what it looks like on obviously and um, so the first thing that i picked up are these high waist dad jeans so these are like everywhere at the moment these are like a straight leg jean and i just think they look so nice on they're really high waisted and really flattering they make your legs look really long as well which is really nice yeah i'm absolutely loving this trend at the moment i think it's just such a different kind of style compared to skinny jean i don't actually find that i like skinny jeans anymore i'd still wear them every so often but i don't really tend to reach for the skinny jean in my wardrobe anymore i prefer like a nice kind of loose fitting one and these are so comfy these are like 15 euro as well no 18 euro i think which is an absolute bargain for a pair of jeans and the quality of them is really nice as well they do actually have like a rip at the knee which i do think it makes them quite different and really nice so yeah i just thought i would show you those first of all they actually had another pair in black that i tried a while ago and they were a little bit too small so i was kind of hesitant when i picked up these that i went up a size i went to a 12 and they fit perfectly so i'm glad that i did go up a size in these because i didn't want them to be too fit i feel like the whole look of these is that they're kind of more loose fit please also ignore my hair in this video it's actually doing my head in literally um yeah but can we see what's going on with that? I do not know. But yeah, we'll just ignore that for now. Okay, so the next thing I picked up then are these like smart joggers. So these are like a tapered kind of, oh, hold on, the legs all twisted. So these are like a muted kind of gray, like a taupe kind of color, maybe like a gray nude, I want to say. And they're got the, they've got this elasticated waistband with the drawstrings. Now the drawstrings, oh, it does actually fold the waist and I thought it didn't, so it does. So yeah, that's positive and it's got these pockets and then it's also got this detailing down the middle of the leg as well which i think is really flattering makes your legs look a lot slimmer and stuff like that and i just think it makes them look a little bit more smart than like a regular jogger i just thought these would be really nice with like a black a plain black bodysuit some nice chunky trainers and a nice little black jacket over the top and um, yeah i just think this is like a staple for anyone's wardrobe if you're looking for something that's a little bit more on the smart side but also like everyday wear as well so i absolutely love love these and i did get these in a 10 and the price of these were only 15 euro they i think they had them in like a khaki color as well which i kind of wish that i could get but i think they didn't have my size so i just got these ones instead but yeah i really really love this color and i think it's gonna go with so many different things okay so the next thing i picked up then is this little nude basic top and i cannot like describe how soft this is like you just need to feel how soft this is it's like such good quality it's really thick as well so it's just like a ribbed um like a low low high neck no um what would you call that like a mid neck turtleneck kind of top um, and this is in a nude color obviously as you can see there and it's just as perfect this is perfect for going with like black mom jeans and um, leather leggings everything basically i just think that these are like such an essential in your wardrobe and the quality of this is just so good i think it was around six euro so really really good value i feel like i need to get them in like every single color that they do because i'm gonna get so much wear out with this and i got this in a 10 to 12 just because i wanted it to be not too fitted that it's going to be then see-through um but it is quite thick anyway so i don't think it's going to be see-through anyway but yeah how many times can i say anyway in a sentence i do not know i feel like this camera is washing me out but yeah absolutely love 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 penny's basics i just think that they're perfect for your wardrobe you don't really have to break the bank and it's almost kind of reminding me of like zara so yeah love that so i then got something that was similar to that as well and i got this kind of mustard color and um, to be honest i don't know how i feel about the mustard shade i kind of thought it was nice when i saw it and when i had it on first and then now i'm looking at it i'm like I don't know how I feel about it, but I thought with like an all black outfit with a black blazer and um, big chunky black boots, this would be quite nice. Just to kind of make it with a little bit of a pop of colour rather than just being in an all black outfit. And um, yeah, again, this material on this is really soft. It's a bit of a thicker rib knit this time, not thicker material, like a just like a chunkier rib. And it also goes up a little bit higher on the neck, so it's got this ribbon 
around the neckline and as you can see it's like a more of like a turtleneck to this one and this again i think was about six euro so an absolute bargain for like an essential in your wardrobe through autumn winter so yeah i'm really glad i picked that up okay so another pair of trousers that i picked up are these checked ones and i'm just starting to love like a smarter trouser i just think they look really kind of like effortless but they also make you look really put together which is what i love about these and i just thought the check in this was really in it's kind of just like it's not like a hound's tooth but it's more like um it's just like a check print basically and it has like little turns up turn ups at the bottom which turn ups <laughs> turn ups <laughs> i don't know what i'm talking about but turn up bottoms we'll just go with that so yeah i just think that these are perfect again with trainers and stuff like that i think it'd be a really nice outfit this with like a black bodysuit and a chunky belt and even some black boots or some white trainers would look really nice with this i feel like this just these would just bring any outfit together so like if you wear in this it's more of like a statement trouser that you don't really then have to worry about what you put with it because it kind of just speaks for itself and um, so these again i think were like 15 euro which i think is a bargain for like any trousers like this in your wardrobe these would also be perfect for work and um, yeah even a night out i'd say not that we're going anywhere anytime soon but these are like some little lacy up heels would be really nice and again with like a black bodysuit and um, black blazer maybe on top as well i just thought this would be a really nice outfit okay so the next thing please just ignore how creased this is i didn't realize it was squished at the bottom of the bag so it's literally creased really really badly um, and what's going on with the label i do not know but yeah it is this green kind of sage green hoodie um did I show this in a video before? I feel like I did. This is like a one that I shown quite a while ago. I have like literally this jumper in like every colour under the sun. But I just thought I'd show you this anyway because it's perfect for like this time of year when you want to be cosy. And I just think this colour is a real like autumn essential like sage is in everywhere at the moment. And yeah, it's perfect. It's oversized so you can wear it with like leggings. You can wear it with like leather trousers and stuff like that. So I got this in a 14 to 16 because I did want it oversized. Um, sometimes I feel like with the basics in primark that they can be a little bit more fitted so i do like to kind of upsize just to make them a little bit more oversized and then i feel like they're a little bit more flattering so yeah i just thought i'd throw that one in my favorite purchase that i bought in primark recently is actually this bag i'm literally obsessed with this bag and i need it in every color because it's just the perfect bag for like going with everything so it has like this longer strap that you can actually extend the strap on this as you can see there that extends or you have like a little fine like a where is it is it in here no i don't know where it is but it has like an also, also like a smaller strap you know so you can just put it over your shoulder which i think is really handy for like a night out again don't know where we're going and yeah this is obviously designed from like this is obviously like prada inspired um so yeah for like literally what was it a tenner i think it's an absolute bargain and they had it in a nude color as well which i kind of wish that i did pick up because i don't know it's still you can't have enough bags and this is like a tenner which is an absolute bargain um so yeah love 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 this you do also get a little purse in there so i don't know what i would use that for i haven't actually used it at all but i'm guessing you could put coins or like would you fit your cards in there probably not it's just stuff with paper so yeah but yeah literally love this bag so much it's just like one of my favorite things that i've got in primark recently so the last thing then i thought i would show you is these eyelashes that i picked up and these are the double trouble eyelashes Okay, so I haven't actually tried these ones yet, but for 150, they look really wispy as well, which I think they look really nice. They kind of like remind me of the So Su lashes. So for 150, I think they're worth trying anyway. Um, but yeah, can't wait to try these on. They're kind of like um, do you know like a rounded shape? So they're not like what's that word? They're not like cat eyes, so they're more like a rounded shape, which sometimes I do prefer if I'm just putting like a bit of colour in my crease and stuff like that and I'm not doing wing liner. But like to be honest with wing liner I probably would wear more of like a cat eye shape one. But yeah, I just thought I'd pick these up anyway. They look like the nicest ones out of like the Primark range of eyelashes. So for 150, I picked up two packs of those. So that's it for today's Primark haul. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like. It really helps out my channel. And also subscribe if you do want to see more videos from me in future. Um, and yeah, just want to say thanks for watching and I shall see you in my next one. Bye.